this warrior? No. But I know his story. I know all their stories. None of them ever think it'll end like this. Reports been coming in from all over. Dominion worlds overrun. Outposts destroyed. A lot more dead boys out there. Warriors. Death is the fate of all warriors. A fate we too may soon embrace. Fate ain't written, Artanis. The way I see it, if Zeratul believed you could make a difference in all this, then this fight's just begun. It is your custom to shake the hand of a friend, is it not? See now why you must separate from the Kala. Its light has faded. I will keep him at bay. I will endure. I have felt his rage, seen his truth. If you will not sever your connection to the Kala, then you will be contained, kept in stasis. I will preserve the Kala however I must. If I must endure imprisonment, so be it. Look here, Hierarch. This material self-regenerates. It is no wonder the research of the Terrans claimed it to be from a recent epoch. My projections place it at several billion years old, if not more. Zeratul's vision said that this keystone can guide us unto hope. What do you think it means? Yes, guide us. It is a code wanting to be cracked. The keystone seems to be able to manipulate energies, but that may not be its sole purpose. I believe it stores its origin point within. Its origin point? Yes, I promise you. I will find out how this will lead us to the Zelnaga. Redouble your efforts, Karax. There is little time. Uh, hey there, your royal ness. 
Man, this is weird. I've never talked to no Protoss before. <laughs> hey. If I have learned one thing from your commander, Raynor, it is that we are not so different, Rory Swan. Continue your report. Right. So, the artifact, uh, the, uh, the Keystone thingy's all yours. We're in the middle of transmitting all our data to your engineer. You have my thanks. Please relay my appreciation to Commander Raynor. Hey, you got it, Skippy. Skippy? Zeratul, old friend. I have the Keystone you believed would lead to our salvation. And yet, faith alone will not defeat Amon. As Hierarch, I was made aware of a location where our Kalai scientists experimented on new weaponry in secret. Within the Glacius facility, the Purifier program has been reborn. We must recover this immensely powerful technology. The Nerezim of Shakuras ritually sever their connection to the Kala. Because of this, they are now the last free Protoss. I must reach them before Amon's armies. of life is extensive. Hold. We are receiving a transmission. Praise the gods. Artemis, you live. Matriarch Vorazun, what has happened here? Shakuras has fallen. The warp gate linking this world to Ire has been reopened. Countless hybrid and Zerg pour from the other side. They've obliterated our cities, decimated our Shadow Guard. We are trying to evacuate the remaining population, but I am uncertain whether we can hold long enough to get them safely away. We will give you the time you need, Matriarch. My Templar are inbound. My Dark Templar were tracking your invasion on Ayo when we were cut off. Then the warp gate opened. What happened, Artanis? Amon used the Kala to seize control of the Templar. I could feel his rage tearing through me, and I was powerless against it. Zeratul found me. It was there that he... He... Yes? He tried to free me. And he succeeded at the cost of his own life. He fell by my hand. It was Amon's deed, not yours. Zeratul came to me with a warning, but I did not act. Because of this, he is now gone, and the stars burn dimmer for his loss. Amon's deed or not, I carry a burden, Matriarch. One that cannot be easily lifted. The Zerg infestation is overtaking Telemetros. Our evacuation is already in great peril. Your raid cannot come soon enough, Hierarch. Shakuras teams with Amon's Zerg broods. We hold only the southwest quadrant of Ptolemetros, and even that is in peril. We must evacuate our people, but the launch bays have been defiled with infestation. Only ground forces can clear them. Once the bays are free, the planetary warp conduit will allow our ships to escape safely. The launch bays will be cleared. Your people will survive, Matriarch. This I swear. You will need the aid of my Dark Templar in this battle. They can strike from the shadows without fear of reprisal. Artanis, I'm detecting a rift opening near your position. Avoid Thrasher. By the gods, it's sieging the warp conduit. Warriors, we must slay it before it destroys the conduit. Strike as one, Templar.
Thrasher is slain, but it will be for naught if the launch bays remain infested. I am the blade of the Narazine. Clever. Cartoon. Moving to attack our nexus point. The darkness rise. What would you ask of us? If possible, we should warp in more photon cannons. They will help our nexus point defend against enemy incursions. From the shadows. All right. If you can reclaim them, the reserves are yours. Conduit is under assault. Fear is an illusion. Be careful. The spore crawlers and overseers ahead can detect our Dark Templar's movements. Slay them first. I am but a I am the blade of the Narazine. From the shadows I come. I will comply. From the shadows I come. I am Thrasher has been eliminated. This would be an opportune moment to clear the launch bays. I am the bl What would you ask of us? I will comply. I am intrigued. the conduit more time. Another Thrasher failed. Is there no end to these abominations? I will comply. State thy bidding. You require my skills. I bask in the twilight. I am here in the shadows. There are cool. Intriguing. We are one with the shadows. Shadows. 
the Narazim. Secured a second launch bay. Well done. Half of the bays are launching evacuation ships. Very well. For the reckoning, state thy bidding. I fear is an illusion. Shadows, I come. has been summoned. This one is in the heart of the city. Thrashers are no match for the Templar. We have purged the infestation. Only one launch bay remains disabled. Solarite reserve now. The solar core should be augmented by the time our forces return, Hierarch. The launch bays have been reclaimed. Matriarch, you may complete the evacuation. You have saved my people, Artanis, and they will never forget it. Zerg poured through the warp gates of tide of flesh and blade. 
They have already overrun Telemetros and are nearing the shrines of Lazul. This world is lost. With such an infestation, Shakuras must be destroyed. Destroy Shakuras? I will not permit this. Permit? Shakuras was my people's home long before we offered your sanctuary upon it. I will not let this world be a den for Amon's forces. Worlds may fall to ash. What matters is that we endure. To lose Shakuras and Aya. We are a vagabond people, Artanis. Our true home has always been Ayr. Let us reclaim it together. It is fitting that the daughter of Raja Gaul decides the fate of the world she helped forge. Let us make preparations at once. I have powered up a new ship subsystem. You can review it in the Solar Core now. Of all the Templar, you never wavered in the belief that our two peoples could live in unity. It is something I admired in you. It is ironic to hear you say this. All this time, I believed you were reluctant to accept the unity I sought. You and I had many a disagreement in the Twilight Council. For day by day, I saw my people losing what they were. I saw our precious old ways erode. You wished to preserve them. I am Nerezim. Dark Templar. I hold great pride in my people. But you are also Protoss. That is the greater affiliation. That is not what the Conclave believed when we were exiled long ago. Your kind had ire. Our culture is all we ever had. <laughs> 